We wanted to give you a view of where we are and uh, here in the rain. Of course, this is Fells Point and there's concern also about Fells Point, Harbor East and Little Italy and flooding that will be happening in this area. We want to go over here right now. We want to show you where the sandbags are are being filled at this point. You can, if you look, it looks like there's just a little bit of sand. Well, that's because they've already gone through two truckloads of sand. They're waiting for the third truck to arrive at this point, and that's because of the heavy rain and the predictions of flooding that Baltimore is providing the sandbags in certain areas of the city. And again, where we are is uh, Thames and Broadway here in Fells Point. The Department of Transportation crews are filling the sandbags. As you can see, just a little bit of sand left at this point, um, but another truck is on the way. And this started around 10 this morning, and sandbags are going to be available until 2 o'clock this afternoon. They're also available in the 5100 block of Frederick Avenue, and there's a limit on the sandbags. You can only have 10 sandbags per person. We did talk to one person who came here to get some sandbags. I was here several years ago to try to get sandbags to keep the water out, so we're going to do what we need to do. Okay, and also because of concern over cars getting flooded out, the Parking Authority of Baltimore City is offering free parking. It started at 9 a.m. today and goes until noon Wednesday at the Fleet and Eden Garage. Also, there is parking, free parking at from 4 p.m. today until 8 a.m. Wednesday at the Little Italy and Caroline Street garages. So there's going to be free parking for people uh, who are worried about uh, their cars being out in the area that uh, might get flooded so but the thing is to get those cars out at the times that those uh, those garages close reporting live from downtown Baltimore Barry Sims WBAL TV 11 news